Perfect. Thank you so much for getting on tonight's Empire webinar. We're super excited what's going on, especially what's coming up events. And I know I want to go ahead and introduce my friend. Um, I've known him for several years in a previous company and got to know him really well. And uh, what's cool is actually we met, I remember at one of the uh, uh, launch parties, and I didn't know I was talking to one of the head people at the company. We just connected, became really great friends. I knew he was going to be very successful whatever he did. Come to find out he did, very successful, he opened a, and launched in a Europe uh, for our previous company. Now he's in this uh, CBD movement, leading the head charge, the CEO of our company, and let me introduce everyone to Blake Schrader. Are you there, brother? All right, I'm here. Can you hear me okay? Yes, sir. Let me go ahead and put the spotlight. There you go. Take that's it away. Oh, no, it's a little dark, I can see. So uh, hopefully that's better. Hey, everybody. Uh, great to be with you. And thank you, Andrew. Uh, real proud of what you're doing, man, and leading the charge down here in Southern California uh, for our company. And Becky, it's always great to see you. You're awesome. And uh, what a wealth of knowledge Dr. Becky brings us. And we're just super lucky to have a person like Dr. Becky in our company who can uh, you know, describe the products in an educated way. And uh, anyway, real happy you're with us, Becky. Uh, great to be on with everybody tonight. Uh, my name is Blake Schrader, like Andrew said. Uh, I'm the CEO of Canaway. I have been now for about uh, 15 months, and uh, man, what a ride it's been. You know, over the course of the, last, of the past 15 months, we've grown the company over 17 times. We've grown for now 15 consecutive months in a row and uh, you know really what our purpose is is just to educate the world about cannabinoids and uh, that all of us actually have an endogenous cannabinoid system and we need to be supplementing that system and the amazing benefits of uh, of hemp and what it can do for you in your life um you know super fun to be part of a company that's growing and in fact i'm just sitting here looking out over the bay right now and uh, we're real excited because we have our uh we have our incentive trip coming up here in October, I believe. We're taking a cruise ship right there from right there. So if you, if you get it uh, qualified for the cruise, you're going to come to our office, check it out, meet everybody, and then we're going to take off and head down to Cabo San Lucas uh, for our best salespeople. We're going to have a great time. I'm sure Andrew can explain all the promotion and how it works and how to get there a little bit later. But uh, we're, we've just been having an incredible time. You know, uh, the month of June, I'm so happy to report. Uh, you know, it's always fun to report the results when they're positive, right? And uh, the month of June was the biggest month in the history of Canaway. And so I just want to congratulate everybody who's on the call tonight, who's in the business and actively building the business. You know, it's always fun to be part of a winning team. And uh, this last month was the biggest month ever in the history of the company. In fact, this last quarter was the biggest quarter in the history of the company. And in fact, you know, we're sitting right now in the very beginning of July through June. You know, so January, February, March, April, May, June, those were the big, if you combine those six months, that would uh, be bigger than the prior biggest fiscal year of the company. And, uh, and we've still got the rest of the year to go, of course, and we've got some great things coming down the pipe. Um, and uh, so, you know, it's always fun to be part of a winning team, and it's always part, fun to be part of something that's growing. You know what I love about this business? You know, uh, most in, in other networking companies that I've been involved in, there were some good companies. But, uh, you know, a lot of times you talk about network marketing or direct selling and the air just leaves the room. And, you know, uh, people don't want to really want to talk about it. This is totally, totally different. You know, if somebody asks me what I do for a living and I say I'm in the cannabis business and they say, excuse me, <laughs> you know, and uh, by the way, it doesn't matter if people have a negative view or a positive view of that. Um, they want to talk about it. This is in the news every single day of the week. It's on the TV, it's on the radio, it's in the newspaper, it's in the, you know, it's uh, in governments. Every day laws are changing. It is such an easy subject to talk about and it's something that everybody wants to talk about. And that's why Canaway is such an amazing vehicle, right? It's not always fun to talk about the company that you're associated with in direct selling. You know, ask a few people that have been around a little bit. It's hard to talk about. This is so easy to talk about and that's what makes it so interesting. And, uh, you know, what else makes it interesting? I mean, uh, you know, a lot of people want to be involved in this space. You know, it's, uh, there's very, very few industries where you can look around and you can say with surety, okay, this industry is going to be bigger three or four years from now than it is today. You know, I mean, I can look at my Apple computer here. 
uh, or is the computer business going to be big, any bigger today than it is uh, five years today? I don't know. Is uh, the furniture business going to be bigger five years today than it is today? You know, I don't know. Here's the thing. Is the cannabis business going to be bigger five years from now than it is today? There is absolutely 100% no question that it will be. The only question is, who is going to capitalize on that? Is it going to be us? Is it going to be Canaway? Well, I'm betting that it is going to be, and I'm giving everything I've got to make sure that it is. And so I would invite you to do the same thing as well. Act with urgency because this is an urgent moment. I don't know, you know, have a look around. Depending on where you live in the country, people are getting into this business in one form or the other. It is happening with or without you. So take advantage of this moment. This is a unique moment in time. We sit here at the end of a prohibition and we have something so, so unique and special in our hands. So I would just invite you to, to really take advantage of this moment. And if you're in Southern California, we've got a great event coming up this weekend. We're gonna be in Orange County. Andrew can share all the details with you. We have the world's foremost expert in cannabinoids who's gonna be there, Dr. Stuart Titus. He's gonna share about all the research that's going on around the world with respect to cannabinoids. He is one of the nicest people you'll ever meet. If you've got a question about cannabinoids, he will stay there all night answering them. Though I urge you not to make him stay there all night. He's such a great guy. Anyway, we have so many special things going on inside of our company and inside of our industry. And when I talk about the industry, I'm not necessarily talking about the network marketing industry. I'm talking about the cannabis, the hemp industry, which is growing and uh, man in the news every single day. So take advantage of that. Use that to your advantage. What we're trying to do uh, in this space is separate ourselves a little bit. We want to be the professional company in a space that sometimes isn't so professional. You know, no matter where you are in the country, no matter where you are in the world, uh, we want everybody to have a great, great experience with our company. We're not trying to be a controversial company. We're just trying to be a company that's on the very bleeding edge of something that is happening. And we want to be inviting to everybody. Our message is for everybody. It's not just for a few people, you know. Um, so I would invite you to get involved and get involved in a big way. And if you're in Southern California, I hope to see you this Saturday in the OC. And Andrew and Becky, I hope you guys are both there too. And I'm looking forward to seeing you guys. And uh, with that, I'll hand it back over. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much. Man, you laid it down. <laughs> Dude, I can't wait. So I'll see you this uh, coming su uh, Saturday in Orange County. I know we're going to have an amazing time. Uh, like yourself's going to be there. Uh, Dr. Stuart Titus will be there, the leading one in charge for um, our, one of our parent companies. I mean, this guy has full knowledge. I mean, once you get it and find out what the CBD movement's all about, you will be passionate. I mean, Blake, you know, you touched on uh, – uh, uh, certain endocannabinoids and i know i'll let dr becky talk about that but one thing real quick before i let you go talk about uh your passion about our nonprofit and how it's going to be impacting so many lives uh it's called uh totally but gosh i can't believe you had to remind me about that i'm a little embarrassed <laughs> about that <laughs> you know uh you know i love that we're in a space that's growing with or without us i love that we have amazing products that people can feel actually feel the benefit from when they start taking them. And you know, I love that we're supporting um, a not-for-profit called ECHO. It stands for Education, Collaboration, and Hope. And really, you know, that's what we're all about in the end. I mean, uh, we wanna make a big, big impact on the world. And we want everybody in Canada to be a part of that. And you know, that's not just saying it. You know, it's one thing to contribute, but it's another thing to become involved in somebody else's life and really experience, um, you know, what we're doing. I think, uh, I don't know uh, if Brian Higuera is going to be down in the OC or not, but uh, if he is, that's an amazing chance to meet somebody whose life has literally been transformed and changed in his whole family's life uh, because, of, uh, because of what we're doing as a company. And uh, it's really quite touching, right? And so ECHO yes. stands for education. We want to become the world's, ECHO is becoming the world's largest resource for education on cannabinoids in the world. It's echoconnection.org. Look under the education tab. I mean, you're gonna find thousands of studies about CBD and cannabinoids that are going on around the world. We're talking about research institutions, governments, universities. Um, it's crazy the amount of research that's going on out there. Guys, we don't have to make any claims about our products, okay? Just point people to the research that's happening around the world and let them make their own conclusion about what the products can or cannot do. Um, you know, that's what I do. 
Um, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a scientist. So I just point people to the research and let them make their own determination. Um, we want to provide a place for people to collaborate where they can get more information. So we have a social network set up that's part of ECHO. And finally, you know, ECHO's mission is to provide hope to the world. So, you know, I personally invite every single one of you, every time you make an order in Canaway, it doesn't matter how much, whether it's a dollar or $10 or whatever you feel, you can donate to the ECHO. And then come to our events and meet the families and see what it is that you're contributing to. Because you know what? It's going to have a way, way bigger impact on you than you're going to have on them. And that's no matter what you contribute. I promise you that. You know, uh, for me personally, it's been such a blessing to meet some of the families that we have in our business that have had, you know, incredible life's challenges that I couldn't even really contemplate. And uh, see what kind of people they are. Really learn from what kind of people they are and how they handle situations and go through, you know, really tough things that are hard to even think about and talk about. And then how, you know, products like ours have made such a big difference. So really at our core, you know, that's what we're all about is, uh, is you know, helping Echo to uh, really provide us a mission of educating the world and providing hope to people that really need it. So uh, thanks, Andrew, for that. Appreciate it. Awesome, bro. Well, thank you so much. I didn't want to take up too much of your time. And so I uh, definitely thank you. Appreciate for your time, brother. And I'll see you this coming Saturday. All right, Andrew and Becky, see you guys both. You're awesome. Bye-bye. Thank you, brother. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. All right, guys. Thank you so much. And so we have our other special guest. And, you know, just to let you know what the history about uh, CBD. I mean, it's been around for centuries. And if you've been following uh, the Facebook posts and what we've been doing, how we've been impacting lives, I mean, gosh, it's incredible how we had Benjamin Franklin was the first person to have a paper mill out of hemp. And then, of course, we have our uh, forefathers, our presidents. They're growing hemp. And then we have, uh, oh my gosh, a car that most recently I just posted that's made out of hemp. Shoes made out of hemp. Uh, my T-shirts made out of hemp. Hats, wallets made out of hemp. And so it goes on and on and on about what hemp could do for you. Well, that's why I'm going to bring a dear friend of ours, Dr. Becky. Uh, she's going to explain to you what's hemp about and what's the difference between medical marijuana and hemp. And Dr. Becky, are you there? I'm here. Thanks, Andrew. It's always an honor to speak to everybody. And I'm very excited about what these products are doing for people, really changing the quality of life for so many. And, and that's why I'm here. And I looked at a lot of companies over the past you know, year, trying to find something that really fit with my personality, who I am in terms of helping people, and also a company that would be growing to the next multi-billion dollar company and i've been with two of them and i know how it feels i know how it looks i know how it grows i know what their ethics and morals and their vision and passion is all about so when i found this company canaway and i listened to dr titus and i learned the difference between hemp and marijuana it really impacted me because i didn't understand i did not really understand so the first slide we're going to talk a little bit about hemp versus marijuana i mean hemp is a very different plant than marijuana it grows very tall it's very fibrous it's very dense and it is used for a lot of industrial purposes. And you know, it's very high in CBD, which is the non-psychoactive component that gives you all these great medicinal properties, helping people with all types of ailments. And we're not gonna make any claims tonight. However, we are helping people on a grand scale with their health. And so when you look at CBD and what we're doing with Canaway, we are in the hemp business. We have a hemp product that comes from Northern Europe, it comes into the States, it's triple tested for purity, it's non-GMO, and it's absolutely phenomenal compared to anything else that's out there. Now, when you look at marijuana, completely different plant, it's very short, it's very bushy, it's high in THC. Most of us are familiar with THC, that gives you the high, it's the psychoactive component. Well, the issue there is there, there's really no industrial purpose for it. It's just grown and developed to give you that high. In the next slide, we'll look at a little bit about the legality in terms of you know, hemp versus marijuana. We are legal in all 50 states, you guys, legal in all 50. So we can ship across state lines. There are no problems there. We are protected. This company has it all going on in terms of protecting ourselves in regards to being able to be legal in all 50 states. Marijuana, as you know, is an issue. There's a lot of states that prohibit it. There's a lot of um, states that will still arrest you for it. I mean, some states are, they're very open to marijuana and THC and getting the high, 
but I want you to realize that Canaway is not in the marijuana business, you guys. We are in the hemp and CBD business, and that's a big distinction. And once I learned that, I recognized this is my right space to be in. And a lot of people gravitate toward our products because they don't want the high. They have to function during the day. They have to be, you know, good at work. They have to be good parents, a good spouse. So they don't want to be, you know, on a, a product that's going to give them the psychedelic reaction and they can't function. So if you go to the next slide, Andrew, and you can go to the next one. I'm going to talk about the endocannabinoid system. So you can go right there. This is really important. This is what turned the corner for me when I heard Dr. Titus speak because I had never heard about this. And in the 1980s, researchers found this system within our body. You've heard of the lymphatic system. You've heard of the vascular system. This is the endocannabinoid system. And what it is, is it's a self-regulatory system that causes our body to become uh, in synergy and homeostasis. What that means, it's responsible for our mood, our hormonal balance, our appetite, our sleep cycles. So it's very self-regulatory. And you know, within our body, we produce endocannabinoid. We produce these cannabinoids that really fuel this system. And these, I'm gonna talk a little bit about the receptors in a minute, but we don't make a lot. I mean, the two major endogenous, meaning from within, producing from within, the cannabinoids are anandamide and 2-HD. You don't have to know the, the names of these compounds, but understand that we do produce them. They're actually in breast milk, but over time we produce less and less, and we have enzymes that will break them down. So we need to fuel with exogenous cannabinoids. That's why CBD is delivering such amazing results. Because when you start to fuel this system, the body starts to become more healthy, the body becomes more of the miracle. And Andrew, you can go to the next slide and it'll show a little bit more about where this system um, resides. We have two types of receptors within the endocannabinoid system, the CB1 receptor, the CB2 receptor. CB1 receptors, and think of receptors as like a docking station for when CBD comes in and they get close to each other and then they react together and they cause this synergy in the, in the body. CB1 receptors are very much in the brain and the peripheral nervous system. CB2 receptors are in the immune system, um, also in other vital organs, like the liver, like your adrenal glands, um, other vital organs that are very essential for balance and detoxification. So when researchers looked at the endocannabinoid system, they noticed that because we produce less endogenous and we weren't getting a lot of exogenous cannabinoids, that people could fall into an area called endocannabinoid deficiency syndrome. When that occurs, you are more susceptible to migraines, more susceptible to irritable bowel, more susceptible to autoimmune, autoimmune disease, it's fibromyalgia. So when we look again, when we're fueling with Canaway's amazing CBD products, we are fueling this whole system so that the body becomes so balanced that we can fight off all of these chronic ailments. So to me, this is what turned the corner because we had a deficiency because after 1937, especially in the US, the government made um, hemp sound like it was marijuana, banned it, there was all other kinds of regulations. So we became very deficient in endocannabinoids. And that is why a lot of people are falling into ailments that are chronically affecting them. That's why we see so much pain and inflammation, autoimmune diseases, neurologic diseases. I'll talk about that near the end of this discussion. But if you think about all the chronic ailments we're seeing, and especially what I saw in my practice, especially inflammatory conditions of the bowel, people that had Crohn's disease, um, they had ulcerative colitis, they had all types of issues with absorption, chronic diarrhea, chronic constipation, pain, inflammation, requiring drugs. And we were just fueling um, the toxicity of the body with all the pharmaceuticals instead of addressing the underlying cause of the problem. So when you think about how we're addressing the true underlying cause, you're going to see people come back to you and they're going to thank you for changing their quality of life on a very grand scale. And that's what fuels me every day. Go ahead with the next slide, Andrew. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about the patent because this is very important. A patent was delivered to a Nobel Prize winning laureate, Dr. Julius Axelrod, who did research on CBD. And basically cannabinoids, they are now deemed by patent as antioxidants and neuroprotectants. Here's why this is important. 
Every single day we eat, drink, and breathe toxins. And when they come into our body, they create something called free radicals. And these free radicals, I want you to think of them as like little demons that are just running around your body and they're causing damage. They're causing something called oxidation. If you think about what oxidation is, it's like the rust on a car. It's like when you cut an apple open and it sits in the air and it turns brown, that's oxidation. It's not good. It's not good for our internal bodies because it can cause cellular damage, DNA damage. It can cause something called cellular dysplasia that can lead to malig malignancies. It can lead to ischemia, inflammatory conditions, autoimmune diseases. So when we take an antioxidant such as CBD, which has a patent saying it is an antioxidant, it combats oxidation. We need this every day, all day. That's why I take my, my premium um, capsules several times a day. I do my AM all the way up until about four o'clock in the afternoon and my PM products before bed because I'm fueling my body with CBD. I'm fueling my body with an antioxidant to combat all the oxidation because even though I feel like you know I eat healthy and I don't do you know da damaging things, there's still oxidation going on in my body and it's happening to all of us. So you have to combat that. The other thing that's really important about this being labeled, the cannabinoids as a neuroprotectant is our brains are, are going through neurodegenerative diseases. And we are seeing so much you know, anxiety, Alzheimer's, um, Parkinson's, uh, chronic traumatic encephalopathy, ADD, ADHD, autism. You, we're seeing it every day. And what's happening is when people are taking the CBD and they're fueling their CB1 receptors in the brain and central nervous system, What's happening is we're creating the homeostasis of the neurologic system. So when we talk about antioxidants and neuroprotectants, the neuroprotectant thing is very fascinating to me. And that's why we see such amazing results in the realm of neurologic diseases. The other thing I want to talk about, and Andrew, you can go to the next slide. We're going to talk a little bit more about traumatic brain injury because being a neuroprotectant, CBD is like providing another helmet over the brain to protect the brain against trauma. So there was a study out of um, Torrance, UCLA in Torrance, California. It involved 446 young adults who suffered auto accidents and related traumatic brain injur injuries. So what was interesting was they started to look at regular cannabis users among this group of young adults they were 80% more likely to survive because they were using cannabis. Now they could have been using THC, but a lot were using CBD. And then what we're seeing going forward is for people that are prone to traumatic brain injury, like football players and soccer players or boxers or you know, anything that puts you at risk for traumatic brain injury, the recommendation is because they're, especially because they're athletes, they don't need the THC, they need the CBD. It's starting to become a recommendation for parents to say to their kids or for coaches to say to their players, you know what, you need to consider CBD as a neuroprotectant for your brain. And that's fascinating, but the studies are coming out more and more talking about that. So chronic traumatic encephalopathy is what happens when people have these traumatic brain injuries on a chronic basis. So like with football players or boxers or MMA players are constantly having their heads hit around they get this traumatic encephalopathy that can absolutely ruin their quality of life. So we have something to offer everybody. And I'll have you go to the next slide and I wanna make a comment too about athletes and, and military. So again, we're recommending this for people that have the potential to have traumatic brain injury. A lot of athletes on the Olympic level, <clears throat> the professional level, and also people like military, people that are in the guard, people that are first responders, people that are pilots, they're getting tested all the time. And a lot of these uh, follow the guidelines of the World Anti-Doping Association, meaning that these athletes and these other professionals have to meet the standards to test negative for over 100 compounds that they're deemed um, you know, illegal. Well, we have two products, we actually have three products. We have um, a capsule that's a pure CBD with no THC. We have an oil with no THC and we have the vape pen that you inhale that has no THC. Our other products have less than 0.03% THC. Guys, you're not gonna get high off of it ever. You probably will never test positive in a drug test. However, you have a subset of people that are so nervous about testing positive that they want something that's pure and we have it and no other company has that. And that's really, really unique and it's a first time in this industry. 
and I, you know, going forward, we'll probably see more products that come out on that line, but you have something to offer those people that say, you know what, I want something that's free of THC completely. Well, we have it. The reason why this was developed is that Canaway was approached by um, countries like Brazil and Paraguay and Mexico because there were a lot of people having dramatic health challenges. However, the worst were the young babies, young children that were having refractory seizures. We're not talking about a couple of seizures a day or a week. These are 300, 400, 500 seizures a day. These kids were deemed terminal. Well, we knew we had something to help them with, but those governments have very strict regulations and they said, no, we don't want anything to do with any THC. So we are not accepting anything, even if it's less than 0.03%. So Canaway went to work and they created non-THC products that we can now have into those countries. Now they have to be prescribed by physicians down there, but you know what, we have them in those countries. And that's where you see the, the dramatic results with these children that have their quality of life back. And it happens like instantly, it happens completely instantaneously. As soon as those drops are put under those kids' tongues, <clears throat> they have remarkable results. So many less seizures and now quality of life, which is incredible. <clears throat> Sorry, I had to clear my throat. I've been talking so much. <laughs> so talk a little bit more about the CBD research because the research is substantial. That was another thing that really got me over the edge. When Dr. Titus spoke, the first time uh, that I saw him was in the end of February here in Phoenix. And he started to go through research because as a physician, I'm very research oriented. I want to hear the studies. I want to see what's backing this. Is it just anecdotal or people just talking about it because everyone can have a placebo effect? This is not a placebo effect, guys. When they look at why these kids are responding with epilepsy, it again, it's the endocannabinoid system. It's those CB, CB1 receptors that are in the CNS in the brain. Let's talk about metabolic syndrome for a little bit. This is for people that are suffering from um, a high risk of cardiovascular disease, hypertension, high cholesterol, um, obesity, type 2 diabetes. Metabolic syndrome is very rampant. I mean, I saw it every single day in my practice. It's, the incidence is still climbing. With metabolic syndrome, the reason we're seeing positive results is that when we've taken CBD, okay, especially um, in the doses like 50 milligrams a day, up to 100 milligrams a day, it's fueling areas like your liver. And when your liver is clogged with fat, you are susceptible to metabolic syndrome. You're, it's called toxic fat. It's visceral fat that sits in your abdomen that's been clinically proven to, be, uh, to increase your risk of the type 2 diabetes, the hypertension, cardiovascular disease, all of that. So when you start to fuel the liver, it becomes the better detoxifying organ that it should be. When it starts to flush the fat and flush the toxins, it starts to work better. Okay, when your liver's working better, your thyroid's working better, your adrenal glands are working better, your metabolic rate is increasing. So people are seeing a, an incredible decrease in visceral fat. What happens when the toxins leave and the fat leaves? All of a sudden, the physician says to the patient, wow, your sugars look really good. Wow, your blood pressure's looking good can't believe this. What are you doing? And so we see a lot of results in the area of metabolic syndrome, broken bones, healing, osteoporosis responding. Let's talk about Parkinson's and Alzheimer's and all the neurologic diseases. So many positive studies with CBD in anxiety and depression, with Alzheimer's, with Parkinson's, with Huntington's chorea, with post-traumatic stress disorder, with chronic traumatic encephalopathy, with seizures. The neurologic list goes on and on and on. We are fueling the brain, okay? This stuff gets into the brain and it fuels it. We've had people with Parkinson's that have significant symptoms that take our product that don't demonstrate those symptoms almost instantaneously. There's no miracles here, guys, in terms of product. Your body is the miracle. And it becomes more miraculous when it's fueled with the right things. This is the right thing to fuel your body. And again, I think you should be taking a little bit <clears throat> every day to just keep the fuel going. With Alzheimer's, there's studies showing that people that have these amyloid plaques, <clears throat> excuse me, in the brain on MRI that have Alzheimer's, they are showing a decrease in amyloid plaques in people that are doing regular CBD. Well, what does that mean? We can use CBD as a preventative for all these different diseases that I'm talking about, or we can potentially help people with the chronic diseases that they're suffering from. So I want you to think about that. Who do you know with all of the above that I listed? You probably know somebody in the realm of that. And then in terms of just pain and inflammation, how many people do you know that have pain and inflammation? Well, we have a product that helps with that. And I just want to say when I was in practice, a lot of my patients you know, came from other doctors that had significant pain or 
I had, you know, the patients that had the inflammatory bowel disease had significant inflammation. But there's a lot of inflammatory conditions out there. You know, you've got fibromyalgia, you've got arthritic conditions, psoriatic arthritis, osteoarthritis. There's a bug flying here. <laughs> Sorry. So, um, so when we take the CBD and we fuel these receptors, the studies are showing that we are decreasing the amount of inflammation in the body. The research is there. I'm not making a claim on that one. Just look at the research. It's everywhere. Well, when I think back to my practice, how many patients came into my office that had pain and inflammation and their doctors were prescri prescribing anti-inflammatories like Vioxx and Celebrex or Aspen, Advil, Motrin, okay, nightmare chronically or nightmare automatically because they can cause ulcerations in the GI tract, GI bleeding, which I would have to go in in the middle of the night usually to help cauterize an ulcer because of anti-inflammatories causing an ulcer in the stomach or the small intestine or sometimes in the colon. And then long-term, those types of anti-inflammatories can cause chronic kidney disease and chronic liver disease. I had a good friend who is a phenomenal formulator, very knowledgeable, but many years ago, he was given strong anti-inflammatories. He wasn't aware of the chronic uh, kidney issues, and he had kidney transplant about five years ago. Almost died. You know, found that he had a daughter he didn't know about, and she gave him a kidney, and he lived. He was on his deathbed. He would not do dialysis because he was all natural, and he didn't believe in machines. He's alive today, but thank goodness for the daughter he didn't know about to give him a kidney. But the point is he suffered that damage because of anti-inflammatories. The flip side is the opiates. Oh my, I mean the Demerol, the fentanyl, the morphine, um, Percocet, Percodan, Oxycodone, Oxycontin, nightmare. People have brain fog, they get addicted. They have constipation that would just blow your mind. Never move their bowels for a week, two weeks, three weeks, sometimes a month, and I kid you not, these are people that were impacted. I'd have to go in, in and clean them out. That's how bad it was. The opiates cause so many overdoses in this country and around the world, and it's, it's become an absolute nightmare in terms of the pharmaceutical industry pushing these drugs. CBD helps with pain and inflammation based on the research. And if you can change somebody's lives and then their doctor comes back and says, how you how you feeling? And this patient says, I feel so much better than I've felt in a long time. I don't have my, my knee discomfort or I'm, I'm more mobile. I, I feel great. And this doctor says, you know what? Why don't we try to wean the, the Demerol? Why don't we try to wean the fentanyl or wean the Percocet? Wow. I mean, if you just did that once in a while, how, how good do you feel? And you don't have to be a physician and go to school like a million years like I did. You can just be a person that loves others that will offer the CBD. And so to me, this is just a life-changing company. It is truly a global movement. You're all part of it. You're not just brand ambassadors. You are the founding fathers of this company because we're just getting started. And again, I've been with two companies that went to multi-billion dollar status and I knew it and I felt it and I saw that they were doing the right things and right by people with the right products and the right research. You have all of that in this company and you have to embrace it and just go out there and share and share and share. And I'll end with this, Andrew, and then I'll have you close it out. The, the product that was recently released, the, the vape pen, I love it. And, you know, think about this. This is a growing industry because, you know, people are doing um, e-cigs. And e-cigs, like in 2003, the revenue was about like 1.7 billion. So it's estimated to be over 11 billion just for e-cigs, okay, um, this year. Well, we've got something that's completely pure. Okay, nothing with nicotine or what, I don't even know what an e-cig is to be honest, but I know there's some nicotine in it. What, cigarettes, over hundred toxins. So we have something that vaporizes CBD, it's pure. It has the bee bong in it. And I'll make mention of that in a second, but it gets the CBD, the pure CBD without THC right into the bronchial system. And you would think, okay, so smoking this stuff, is it really gonna help your lungs? Absolutely, because it's gonna dilate the bronchioles. It opens up the vascular system. It gets into your bloodstream. So people that have respiratory issues, I will not name certain disorders, but you will be amazed at how they're responding. And I didn't really understand that until I heard Dr. Titus talk about it and I started to read up on it. So the vape, there it is. There's the vape pen and I've got mine sitting right here. It's amazing. So if you haven't tried it, you definitely want to give that a try. And the industry is growing and growing in that region. So you have a huge, huge market. I just had a lady and she's dealing with some very... Um, serious, serious health challenges. And all she did was order a bunch of the vape because she wanted to get it right into her system. And she didn't want, you know, the toxins and she wanted ash free, smoke free, portable, taste great. And also with the bee bong and some other herbal ingredients, 
B Bomb's in a bunch of our products. Like it's in our skincare, it's in our AM, it's in our PM, it's in our vape. B Bomb is a, a group of nutrients and it's been handed down from the Korean dynasty since like 1547 from Korean royalty. And these doctors put these nutrients together in a way that creates chi in our body, okay? So we're talking about um, Ayurvedic herbs, like Indian herbs, uh, adaptogens, which help your body adapt to physical and emotional stress. When it opens up your chi, it opens up your flow. It opens up your energy. So if you think about a, a vessel, like a blood vessel that's clogged, it has a heart, you know, you have a heart attack because all this clogging is going on. This is opening up everything and it's opening up your energy and your flow and your meridians. And so when you do that, true homeostasis happens and the bee bong potentiates the absorption and the efficacy of the CBD. So we've got something extremely unique. So I love the vape because there's no THC, it's portable, doesn't have the toxicity, it has the bee bong, has other herbal ingredients. And you know, it's just, and it's affordable too. So um, guys, it's, it's an honor to talk with all of you. I, I love you all. And if I could just impact a couple people to go out there and positive change and I've done my job tonight, and um, really appreciate the, the opportunity as always, Andrew. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Becky. Thank you so much. And you're, you're so right about it. It's, uh, it's incredible. This vape, I have it in my hand and I love using it every single day. And uh, it's helped me so much because right now, usually around this time, I always cough and I go run for my uh, uh, inhaler, which I hate taking because the fact that it has uh, this uh, a butyrol in it and it always makes me shaky always makes me uh fidgety and i i just don't like what it does and so taking my 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 cbd every single day i think i know it's helped me and again i tell people look it i'm not a doctor not a, a physician we can't cure can't treat can't diagnose don't even ask me <laughs> that's why i have dr becky too because of her background i mean her knowledge i mean it just goes to further extent, it talks about all our products we have. I mean, we even have this incredible uh, uh, CBD essential oils. Yeah. I mean, this stuff, it smells It smells good, by the way. Every time someone asks me, hey, what's that new cologne? Oh, it's, it's great, cologne. CBD. <laughs> it's, it's CBD cologne. <laughs> but uh, it's, it's incredible. And one thing, too, is uh, everyone asks me this question. Uh, what's the age limit? And Dr. Becky, what, what do you... In terms, well, look at what we're seeing, you know, in with the kids, you know, in Israel and Mexico, they're babies. They're babies oh. taking the, the CBD. So to me, there's there's no limit. I mean, babies up to when you're 120. I mean, there's really no limit. And I guess you know what I should say is like if you have somebody that's really really health challenged, they're on a lot of medication, just have them um, go to their doctor and say, you know what. I would like to do this, but I would like you to follow along because I want to really get my body back into balance and have a quality of life. I, I tend to tell people, don't go ask your doctor because if they don't know, then what they're not up on, they're down on. And so mm -hmm. you can take them information, you can give them the link to um, you know all the research, they can do their due diligence. But I would say for somebody that's like, well, I'm not sure, just go to your doctor and say, you know what, I really want to do this, I want to change my life, it's completely safe, babies are taking it for seizures. So um, that's what I would recommend. Awesome. Awesome. There you go. And guys, for those that came on, get with the person that shared this hemp uh, webinar with you and feel free to do a three-week call with myself, Dr. Becky, or their upline. And those who want to just try the product, awesome. And for those that want to know the business, stay on with us right now, just a few minutes. And I'll let you know that this is not some ground floor opportunity. We're not going to pitch you a five-star opportunity. We're not going to say, you know what, <laughs> get in and get rich. Um, this is a CBD movement. I mean, Blake earlier said this, everyone's talking about it. Yep. I mean, for the first time, like Dr. Becky, the first time, it's easy to talk about. <laughs> it is. It's, it's super easy. And it's funny because you asked me to talk about this last year. I have no clue. <laughs> I thought it was opposite. <laughs> and, and I always thought it was, okay, it's marijuana. It's, it's not. Uh, what's hemp? It's the same thing. And like I was talking to my buddy Natalie earlier today, I said, you know what? I always tell people, is a grapefruit and orange the same thing? 
no, it's it look, yeah, it's round. Yeah, it's uh, it's almost the same, looks the same color, but it's totally different. And so that's that's all we're doing is educating. And if you notice on our live Facebook, I never mentioned the name of the company. Shoot, I didn't even mention the name of the company in the webinar. This is an Empire webinar, right. and that's a that's the best part about it. Is like Dr. Becky kept saying, it's not her, myself, or anyone else. This is re research, government research. This is also medical research, universities, doctors. I mean, it's been around for centuries. I mean, since 1800 to 1937, hemp was used in the United States for 100 illnesses. Just Google it. It's incredible. So, guys, right now, if you love to join the CBD movement, get with the person. Ask them, how can I start? How can I become a brand ambassador? And go ahead and select the package. We have different packages to start from. We have amazing packages. My, my favorite, of course, is the AM, uh, the midday, pre, midday, which is a premium hemp oil, and the PM. The PM is great, especially with kids. <laughs> I give it to my little kids. Uh, they sleep great. And the vape, I, I love. I mean, it's, it's easy to use. Take it around anywhere. No nicotine, uh, no chemicals, no synthetics. And guys, I'm super excited and passionate about sharing this every single day with everyone. And thank you so much, Dr. Becky, for being on tonight. And guys, thank you so much. I'm going to go ahead and end the call tonight. And I can't wait for you guys to come on to the red carpet this Saturday. Uh, it is at 11.30, so get there early because I know it's going to be a packed house. And for those that haven't got their tickets already, get them now. I believe they're still on sale for $20. So go in your back office. Uh, go ahead and purchase them. For guests, it's free. Uh, afterwards, if you'd like to uh, learn more about uh, the CBD movement, you can go ahead and purchase a ticket there as well. Or maybe your brand ambassador can purchase a ticket for you. Other than that, guys, you take care and have a blessed night. Thank you again, Dr. Becky. Thank you, Andrew. Bye.